definitely going to need. And that team doesn't have much support. Except RNG on the holy crap, it's a mono ice. It is a good thing I didn't bring the other team. Oh boy, okay. VGC versus mono ice. So... It's a snow globe. Oh boy. Um, so Rotom's practically useless, except for its ability to T-Wave. And is that really worth bringing it when Arcanine and Fluttermane just do so well? Hydreigon's out of the question. Hydreigon's not. <laughs> Hydreigon's not showing up. It'd be so ballsy to bring Hydreigon to this battle that I actually might do it. Um, I feel like we have the core four I kind of need to bring. Oh boy. Yeah, not against the Snowcloak team. Hydreigon's not going to outspeed Snowcloak. Um, okay. Actually, no, no, no. Don't. I'm not going to bring out Fluttermane yet. Because I feel like Fluttermane needs to be set up in the right position. Rotom, I'm not going to bring. I don't see any reason to bring Rotom. Rotom may do something, like there's a Frost Moth there. But, like, it's not worth it. Like, Hydreigon could have really only done something against, like, Frostmoth. Frostmoth and Backscalibur, maybe Frostlath. Alright, so we have the Frostlath and Barack Obama Snow. We got Snow Warning popping up. We got Intimidate going off. Okay. So I think I have a really good turn one play here. I think I have a really good turn one play here. I think this is a really good play. I hope. I hope so. Really depends on the moves used. Like, again, there's certain things that could screw me over here. But... Okay, so no protects are going off, so we get a straight up T wave on the Frost Last. That's really good. That's really good. You're gonna Aura Veil. I don't think that's gonna save you here. I don't think that's gonna save Barack Obama Snow here. I was gonna say, if they lived that, I would have been so amazed. But I just could not see it happening. I'm gonna take my recoil. Frostlass is going to blizzard. Ah! <laughs> Dang. I'm pretty sure I'll thaw out on a Flare Blitz anyway. but Like, I'm pretty sure Fire-type moves guarantee a, a thaw out. So, if that would have been on Grimmsnarl, I'd be so salty. We got a Crab Abominable. Um, should I just... <laughs> Just do it again. <laughs> I have to Flare Blitz here, though. We're just gonna... We're gonna rotate around the Flare Blitz and the T-Wave. <laughs> Everything gets a T-Wave. <laughs> Everything gets a Thunder Wave, because... Why not? Yeah, I was gonna say, Flare Blitz should melt it. Wow, that thing lived as an Aura Veil upset. That, make, that makes sense. Frostlass is going to get paralyzed. Frostlass is getting paralyzed. You're going to Brick Break. Not going to knock out the Arcanine. So Arcanine is going to live for one more turn. Now, unfortunately... There is not much... That... Grimmsnarl can do here, but what Grimmsnarl can do is Grimmsnarl can parting. Well, yeah, let's parting shot that Crab Abominable and get out of here. And then let's basically kill ourselves on a Flare Blitz. Because there's nothing else I can really do. 
Okay, Abominable is going to protect. That's fine. We didn't need to get out this turn. But we are going to knock out the Frostlass, which is good. It's really good. We're going to knock ourselves out in the process, but it's okay because... We're not. Okay, so I guess it took so little. I guess it took so little. I thought it was at 9 HP left. I don't know where I got the 9 from. Alright, we got Bex Baxcalibur is scary. In fact, Baxcalibur is the reason I probably should have brought Hydreigon. But I was kind of afraid of what was going to happen, so... What I do know is that that thing gets set up in sweep, so we need to get a taunt off on that thing. Because I don't want to screw with it. It's gonna go... Dragon Terra. Okay, yeah, Hydreigon would have been really nice. I should have brought Hydreigon. It would have been so ballsy, it would have been good. I don't want that thing de-dancing, so... It's gonna glide rush, okay. Oh no, the emoji spam. Ah, uh, that thing's fast. Is that Choice Scarf? Well, actually, my Hydreigon, my, I don't think my, um, I don't think my Arcanine had any speed investments. That could be why. Um, I need to go Fluttermane right here. Fluttermane can handle the rest, I think. We're going to get our booster energy up, so we're going to insta-activate a, um... We're going to insta-activate our special attack boost, so... And then we're going to try to finish this off with Parting Shot on Crabobinable, which should do the job. Because I don't think Baxcalibur is going to live here. And from there... Well, yeah. we basically just crippling the Crabominable. <laughs> With a, and then sending out a Great Tusk as a result, so. Yeah. We're gonna get that back Scalibur out of there. And that thing's gonna Ice Hammer. Oh, the Ice Hammer miss. That's so bad. <laughs> That's so bad luck. Oh my goodness. Alright. Then from here, we just kind of double down. Let's say, I didn't think it was going to live a moon blast, but. Yeah, GG Shellos. Really fun team, though. I love the Snow Cloak team. I was so tempted to bring Hydreigon, but I didn't know if you were going to bring back Scalibur, and I was like, uh, that's so ballsy and could just lose me the game over a better spot. But yeah, GG, that was fun.